Hi, I'm Bisal Gautam. I was born and raised in Nepal, a very beautiful country, rich in wildlife, nature and mountains. I have been working as a freelance wildlife photographer over a decade now and I prefer to be in the field to capture the wildlife activities regularly. Academically, an electronics and communication engineer, I transformed myself to a wildlife photographer. And believe me, this change was not an easy one. This transition period was painful, sometimes depressing and some situations out of my control. But I knew there is purpose in this pain and everything happens for a reason. An unexpected career change from engineering to the wildlife photography was the biggest surprise to everyone surrounding me including my family. It took my significant amount of time and energy to convince them. Now the situation has changed. I feel much relaxed and comfortable with the strong support from my family, especially my wife and my daughters. Presently, limited as an ICT consultant for a very few overseas projects, I adopted wildlife photography as my profession. Past experience of traveling, backed up by my education, now the photography is my full-time job. Wildlife photography may seem exciting for an aspiring wildlife photographer, but there are some distinct disadvantages to this occupation. The natural habitat for wildlife can be in remote areas, tropical lands and primitive settings, far from the assistance a photographer may need in case of injury. Although not all wildlife photographers subject themselves to these unsafe conditions, there's always a risk when wildlife is present, simply because the photographer isn't dealing with domesticated animals. Trust me, it's not a thrilling hype. In real, I have faced the attacking rhinos. I have felt the pressure of air built by the speed of this monster passing by an inch from the side of my body. And that exactly 1.56 minutes was an extreme tense moment of my life and taught me a lesson while is wild. I have walked numerous times inside this deep jungle and never met such an incident before. Moral, don't be overconfident in the wild, no matter how many times you have been there. Wildlife photography is both rewarding and frustrating, even for experienced photographers. While a great photo is something to treasure, the challenges of wildlife photography can leave beginners feeling a little lost. It requires a lot of patience. It's not like other genre of photography where you choose your subject, adjust your gear and shoot. Many of times I have returned empty from my tours. Many of times I didn't even pull my camera out of my bag. Other most common challenge with wildlife photography is the job market. Wildlife photographers aren't always in high demand. World-renowned photographers worked for years to hone their craft. For you to be noticed in this field, you need to be a distinct and well exposed in widespread mediums. The smartest way to get maximum exposure is by joining the renowned photography clubs. And one such active club I have joined myself is Asian Wildlife Photographers Club, AWPC. AWPC helps wildlife photographers by exposing them to the greater market. Being a member of AWPC, you are eligible to many exciting rewards like free tours, wildlife workshops, and even grants. Keep shooting, love nature, and cheers.